to talk about affordable looks for Valentine's and Galentine's Day. Yes. That's coming up the day of love. And then Ardina is gonna pair a fragrance with each look. Yes. So of course, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you are interested, please stay tuned. So each look I'm going to put on the screen so they'll pop up um, so you guys can see the look and the price. Um, the first one, I actually did two websites. So the first website we're gonna go over is Nasty. Name eight, baby. Um, it's Jack. It's Jackson. Nasty. Seventy percent off all the time. So it's just some super cute looks on there. Um, the first one, as you'll see when it pops up, is the You're Losing Your Touch Velvet Suit. It's like a pink raspberry color. Um, super sexy. Yes. This could be dressed up or dressed down, and it's so versatile because you could wear each piece with something else. So you could pair the velvet pants back to a different blouse. You could pair the blazer back with a different pant. So I really love that about this suit. And I think that's what makes it so affordable as well because you can wear it so many different ways. Um, I think paired together, they are about, it's $111, which isn't oh, bad for a suit. suit. Yes. And it's velvet, like come on. And you know that's yes. in style. Um, again, this would be super sexy for Valentine's Day. You could wear it with your guy. Or your girls, however you want to do it. And so, Arzina can tell us what fragrance she thinks would go best. Okay, you guys. So, when I look down, it's because my notes are down here. Same here. My notes are in my um, Okay, <laughs> raspberry velvet pantsuit. Um, because this look was really androgynous to me, juxtaposed, yes. you know, um, I thought about it and I figured if you're showing up wearing it the way you have it pictured, you got to be that girl. Yes. And so, I paired it with. Dolce and Gabbana's the only one because yeah, that's my jam. there's not a lot of people who could pull that off. <laughs> and so we have notes of bergamot, chocolate, no, was it chocolate? Forgive me y'all, nope. Bergamot, coffee, and caramel. So, very you know, spicy. very spicy, very warm, very Valentine's Day, Galentine's Day. Appropriate. All right. The only one, Dolce & Gabbana. I wear the only one as well. It's so good. good. And it's really good for like the fall, winter, I think as well, because yes. it's super like warm. Mm -hmm. And then as she said, this suit is an androgynistic, so you yeah. can kind of give it that like boyish, like sexy feel. I like that a lot. And I'm a pants girl, so yes, you nine times out of ten, I'll be in pants before I'm in a dress. Yeah, and a so, long pony. Yeah, yeah, and a long snatch. Yeah, and some like drop earrings. I Ooh, think just yeah. like super cute. So. Yeah, ladies, hit to Nasty Go. Um, and it might be even cheaper now. And then closer to Valentine's Day, I'm sure they'll have an even bigger sale. Yeah. So that'll be super cute. Express shipping, y'all. So the next look we are going to do is the Bridal Feather Cup Blazer Mini Dress. I love this dress. It came in pink, um, black, and like a lime green. Mm -hmm. So it has all colors you can play with, all colors that are in right now and on trend. Um, I think it's super sexy and then just the feather detail on the sleeves is just yes. like that very classy like ladylike type of thing. Mm -hmm. I think it's so cute and I think the way it fits the bodice as well as you guys will see in the picture is just super beautiful. I think our tall girls can get away with this, our yeah. short girls can get away with this and of course I am a fan of alterations just because of my body type so anything that may fit a little boxy or doesn't fit me the way I want it, I'm taking it to get all to bring it in, in the waist like you can really just play around with this um i think another good thing with this like i saw it with like a strappy heel because your legs are out so something mm -hmm. that's like going up the leg or you mm -hmm. can even pull out a thigh boot a boot that's how yeah a boot, a boot would boot. be like super sexy as yes. well so i think that would be super fun um i would also 
give myself a pony or something snatched off the face for this yes, as definitely. well. And then some super dramatic earrings. So, you know, mm -hmm. pair back with a little purse and you're good to go. You're good to go. Oh, and one more thing. Um, this dress was $48.60. Like free. Wow. Free 99. Free, free 99. 99. That's crazy. I know. It's free. So, you're so good at finding stuff like that. You know, I try. Okay, so for the pink um, feather cuff blazer dress, to me that's giving girl boss vibes. Yeah. And so when I was going through my fragrance collection, I was just like, what screams to me girl boss? And so I have um, a perfume that not only was created by a girl boss, it's a black owned girl Ooh, boss. So, and I don't see this a lot everywhere, and I don't even see a lot of reviews here on YouTube for it, but this is Aisha Nicole. I mean, and it's her this. signature fragrance. Oh, take mm -hmm. a whiff. Take, take a whiff for the whiff. girls. And um, we have Indian mm. roses, vanilla, caramel, and tonka bean. And you know, Kay, you know my absolute fragrance in the world is Delina. Delina. Um, yes. By Parfums de Marley. Smells and good. Aisha Nicole has the um has the Delina DNA, but warmer. Okay. Warmer. And so um, yeah, I would just say give it a try she's on instagram um we'll link her stuff Tip below, below. Yeah. and um you know shout out a girl boss yes. and it's black, black girl owned. magic yes. and you know i'm all about black owned so i love that and it's the month of february we're going into february so black history month it's, i didn't even think See, of that, look at I that. that there you have it y'all look at that yes okay so our last look from nasty gal is the Plunge Extreme Batwing Sleeve Mini mm -hmm. Dress, which you guys will see. Um, this dress was $29.70. Like, what? 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 Free. Wow. Free. Free 99, as I always say. I love this dress as well. I think it's super flirty. I mm -hmm. love like that it's not super tight fitting. It doesn't really hug the body. So if you're not feeling your best, you know, grow up, you're a little bloated. It ain't gonna show your belly. Like it's just really like that balloon. And I love the details of the sleeve and how yeah. they tie at the um, wrist. It's just super cute and I just love satin. Um, and that orange color, the I color. think it's beautiful. That orange is gorgeous. It's so pretty and it looks good on pretty much any skin tone. Absolutely. So I think this would be so cute. Um, it is shorter, which I like. I like to show leg because I'm short. So when I show leg, I feel like it makes my legs look longer. Yeah. Um, you can really give like a 70s vibe with this and do some like super fire boots. Mm -hmm. You could go more classy. You can do a pump with this, a point yeah. and toe pump. You could go chic and you could do something like that straps all the way up the leg. It's pretty much whatever you feel, um, whatever you're comfortable with, I think as well. And depending on where you live, if it's cold, if it's hot, you know, you could pair it back with pretty much anything i think any kind of hairstyle down with this would be super cute yes. and because the neckline is plunged i would do probably something statement on the neck even if it's dainty it doesn't have to be huge i'm not a huge like chain necklace girl but i love you know i always wear my name necklace with my little bezels in there <laughs> you know such a nice gift so i like that but you could kind of pair it back with anything yeah. so i think this yeah. was super cute yeah all the looks you found were really versatile and that was that was really helpful to the girls okay so orange back wing dress i pulled out a fan favorite you know everybody is into this now but i thought it was perfect because when you sent it to me i said oh girl's gonna be cold she's gonna need something warm so yes. i pulled out fan favorite and our, our girl our girl <laughs> shout out to the to the head girl to the head girl that um, Kyra. Kyra for bringing this um really on the scene for everyone and the notes in ebony wood are ebony cloves and pink pepper it's really simple and the reason why i picked this is three notes in that dress is simple, simple you yeah. know but it has but maximum effective. impact yeah. exactly so i thought this would be a great pairing um ebony wood with the orange bat wing yeah, I love Ebony Wood. It's literally only like 20 something dollars. Mm -hmm. I think the smallest one is like 17. Wow. And it's such, it lasts all day. Mm -hmm. And then it's a good mixture for, you can mix a lot of stuff with like, Ebony Wood. Layer you can layer it. Yep. So I think that's um, super cool. And so that wraps up for Nasty Gal. Um, the next website I did was Misguided, which I did an additional mm -hmm. three looks. So we'll go ahead and get into that. Okay, so. 
Now we're on to Misguided. Um, this first look is my absolute favorite. Awesome. It's like me in a look. If I was a look, this is what I would wear. Mm -hmm. um, super sexy, super chic, and super edgy. Like that is me in a nutshell, and that's what this outfit gives. As you guys can see, it's two-piece snake print. It comes with like the bustier top and then the wide leg pants. Like, huh? That's, that's like it's a vibe it just get, like when you walk into wherever you're going with your girls or your guy like everybody's going like who is that yeah. and what she do mm -hmm. and like it just speaks for itself the print is beautiful and then it's almost like met uh, metallic mm -hmm. so it has like that shine beautiful for pictures obviously because we all want to take a pic at least I do <laughs> I'm gonna get a pic um super cute this was on sale as well. The pants, I want to say, were $39. What? And I think the top was $30. Um, okay. And it went from a size 0 to a 14, which I thought was great because it's very versatile. But again, this is another piece where you can pair the top with something else. Yeah. You can pair the bottoms with a different type of top. Like You can really play around with it. But it's so edgy. And that is what I love about Rainbow. this. I love it. And I, I agree. This was my favorite look from it as well. But it took me back to a place, okay? It took me back to the Tom Ford era at Gucci. Okay. As soon as I saw that, I was like, that's Tommy, baby. Okay? <laughs> and so um, what I did was I paired it with a perfume that came from Tom Ford's Gucci era. Okay? And so this is an oldie but goodie, never leave my collection. Um, they call it catnip for men, so be careful. <laughs> <laughs> I need some of that. Gucci Rush. I don't think I've ever smelled this. It's very, it's one of the, it's kind of like um, most fragrances where that- I feel like I've smelled this on you. No? I, I wear it. Yeah, I, I feel like it. I've, It's, it's one of those like ones you. where you're either gonna love it or hate it. There's mm -hmm. no middle for it. There's no middle for her. We'll see. Yeah, she's she's spicy girl. That's a spicy girl. Oh, it smells good. Mm -hmm. But it smells like it could be unisex. Oh, absolutely. I'm sure it men gives do. you like a strong. But then it gives me Tom Ford because I feel like Tom Ford is so unisex. Yeah, and like even everything. Though, a lot of my Tom Fords, I feel like a man could wear. Oh, absolutely. But even though he didn't create that, that came that was inspired by, by his, his collection. collection. So um, that, that look is very Tom Ford. Okay. And that look also reminded me of what he showed for uh, spring and summer yeah. 2022, yeah. That, that whole metallic. Because, you know, I was tempted to go with Metalik. And then oh, I was like, yeah. that's too easy. That's too easy. Metalik is a vibe, too. Yeah, she is. I she forgot is. about her. She could go with that, too. She could go with that. And the bottle matches the... the it does. <laughs> that whole it's very thing. Auntie K. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> So the next look I thought was super cute and flirty was the um, Peace and Love Lime Color Sequin Disc Long Sleeve Crop Top and it has like the matching skirt. Mm -hmm. I would also wear this I think on a vacation. That's kind of like my vibe. Mm -hmm. I, could, I would put this on. Um, the skirt is a little short but I think that's spicy especially if you're going out for V-Day. This is like V-Day in Miami. That's what it's Absolutely. giving me. Like, Absolutely. you flew me out. 20 minutes will get flew out, out all this pieces is paper. You know, I'm just, you know, I'm going to show up to the vacation. It would have to be somewhere else. <laughs> or you'd be a cold girl. I would be freezing here. So you flew me out somewhere and you know, I had to show up to the occasion. As I always do. Okay. So I had to show up. And I would definitely rock this. I love it because it's bright. And I think, like, we still have not got out of that lime green era. Like, mm -hmm. lime green and that... We'll take the green, all greens, like we're not leaving that. Like that's still on trend yeah. for us right now. I'm and I love that. that it's like sequin disc. Like I think that's super cute. And it also plays off like that 60s vibe as well, which I think is like super fun and flirty. And then you can play around with colors with this. Like yes. I think you should do a pop of color on the shoe, even a pop of color on the bag because it's so bright. Yeah. It's just giving center of attention. It's giving here I am super sexy and I would definitely do like a sleek bun or something mm -hmm. like that and definitely like a drop on the earrings like I would definitely go all out with this one it's yes. like such a vibe what were you feeling for this I was feeling because she was a citrus girl I said well let me put her on oh, this is my girl girl uh, right here fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Tom Ford's bitter peach that's what I put with her for those of you who 
you know, were distracted by the C-19 and never heard of her. Okay. She has obviously peach, blood orange, mm. rum, mm. styrax, mm. and vertebrae. Mm. Y'all love bitter peach. Again, this is a hater love though. People, oh. There are people. There are people. And that, exist, and that baffles me. There are people who I'm exist baffled. on the planet. This right here that do not was like her. all three hundred of my dollars. Absolutely. And I would buy it again. Absolutely. And then you put me on because I now mix it with baccarat because you put me on. So I've been doing that since my birthday. She told me like you have to mix it with baccarat. Oh, honey. Yeah. But there are people. Oh I wore it yesterday. I had a brunch yesterday, um, a brown girl's brunch. It was super Ooh, cute, super nice. fun. And I wore it. I let the girls smell it. They were like, what? I'm like, I know. There are people I who know. don't like her. I, like, let's have a conversation. Why? They exist. I don't know. They're I can't. That, that right there, that's like my, that's definitely one of my go-to's. Cool yeah, she's epic. And she's empty. Like she got a corner. She's done. She, yeah, you got her up to the light. <laughs> I don't know. So our last look from Misguided is our black cohort satin feather. Oh, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Let me go back. That um, set was the top. I think was forty three dollars, wow. and then I think the bottom was forty dollars. So mm -hmm. that wasn't bad either for a two piece. Now moving on. So our black cohort satin feather hem straight leg pants and this has a matching top as well mm -hmm. uh, Here we go again with the feathers, but I think this is super cute. Yeah. This is for that girl That's like, okay, I'm going somewhere, but maybe I don't really feel like doing the most But I do still want to look chic. I still want to feel good. And I still want to look sexy all black always gives that like always. honestly all black you always just gonna you gonna look good. Like you, that's can, a you can go you can go so inexpensive all black and still look like money. Exactly. Yeah. Still look like money. Obviously still smell like money, depending on what you have on. Yeah. Um I just think this was super chic. It has the feathers around the cuffs and around the pants, which is like so cute. Um I think it fits like super well. It'll show the shape of you as well. Yeah. And I think you can pair it back with so many things, like maybe like a bag that has some rhinestones or bedazzle on it to mm -hmm. like give it that pop. Same with maybe like your earrings to kind of just yeah. give that bling so you do kind of still pop out. And I think it's like super comfortable. So again, if you don't want to do too much, but you still want to look good and know you're going to look good and maybe you're not feeling, you know, black is slimming. So yes. that part too. So <laughs> that I think that's it. like super cute. Yes. Um, the pants were 39 and this wow. top was $20. Wow. So that was like super cheap, super inexpensive, but you still look like you paid good money for what you're wearing. Wow. So what did you have to pair oh, with? Right. So when I saw world? that um, set, it was giving me rich auntie vibes. Yes. That's very rich auntie. Yes. She's booked and busy. Catch her when you can. She'll see you on Christmas. Yes. So what do you need? She'll send it. Okay. So um, for that one, I, okay, you guys, I, I am biased. I'm a Tom Ford girl. I'm a Tom yes, you Ford are. girl. Okay. So I figured, you know, rich aunties, every time you're around them, you're having an experience. You yes. know what I mean? Yes. And so I paired her with Tom Ford's Eben Fume because this is an experience in the bottle. Okay. You know, if you're wearing this, the wearer, you know, is bringing something into your life. And so <laughs> I very stop and stare, honey. So let's see. For mm -hmm. this fragrance um, has incense. Palo Santo, Violet, and Rose. And so it's going to be, it's going to really appeal to both sides. You know, a man can wear this say, and like a woman can wear this. Both um, can wear. But that's that Tom Ford magic. That's the, that's the Tom Ford DNA. So, yeah. Love that. So I did have um, one more. This is not a full outfit, but I wanted to pair mm -hmm. something black on just to pop in that I thought was super cute. Nice. It's this Queen of Hearts crop red blazer. It's from Pink Elephant, um, black owned and very in Philly. I love this blazer because it does have like the structure on the sleeve and it's like super open. Mm -hmm. And depending on how spicy you want to get, you could literally like do some boob tape and <laughs> keep it moving a nice neck piece and this could be paired again back with a pant or a skirt mm -hmm. um, the blazer itself is 77 and this is just something that if you already have something in your closet maybe you need that one piece to add 
to add to it. It's very bold. So I know any of the fragrances that um, yeah. I didn't listen to would pair back with that. Well, if we're gonna stick like on, we'll bring Aisha. Yeah, we'll bring Aisha back. back. So we're, we're, we're giving our black, okay, black girl magic. So Absolutely. that was like our one-off piece. And then my pajama set because, yes. you know, if our girls are not going anywhere because of COVID and Omicron, because you know, that's still circling today. Yes. Target had like the cutest loungewear and PJs. So I have this super cute um, yeah, it's really cute. lip kisses mm -hmm. loungewear top and it came paired back with some shorts. And that was only $20 for like the whole set. And so they had so much stuff. And I thought like that was super cute. And um, just another shout out to Target because they have a whole Black History Month section. Wow. Since we're just, you know, going into the black owned. So I thought that was like super, super cool. They had so much stuff in that. But yes. So let's thank Ardina for coming. Oh, anytime. And talking anytime. about our fragrances. And we'll do this again mm -hmm. um, for, spring, for, summer. for spring, summer, and different looks like that. I definitely, I just think um, perfume just adds that last little bit yes. of jazz and touch and so many people are not into it mm -hmm. i think they should definitely get into it yeah. and there's just so many things you could play with and there's so many websites now too if you don't mm -hmm. want to pay 300 dollars a bottle you, get a sample? you can get a sample yep. you can get websites where they make a dupe with pretty much the same oh, yeah. notes yeah. and they may be like 29 39 dollars i learned of one yesterday called dossier mm -hmm. um d-o-s-s-i-e-r okay. where they have um Dudes for Killian, okay. Baccarat, Tom Ford, and um, one of the young ladies said it's like, she has the actual fragrances, mm -hmm. and then she purchased the dupes to see how they were doing, and she said they were like spot on. Okay. So I thought that was super cool too, okay. and they ranged $29, $39, $49 instead of, you know, just to be, what do you want to say, budget okay. friendly. Economical. Economically yeah. cautious. What's on, what's on your fragrance wish list right now? Oh, I am, okay. So, you know I still want the Vanilla by um, Huda Beauty Sister. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It, Luna? It? Yes. I'm looking Kayali. for the Kayali mm -hmm. Vanilla. Um, I think I want Killing in Love, Don't Be Shy. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm feeling, I okay. think. And I think I want, I'm looking at a Barreto fragrance as yeah, well. They make some good stuff. And I feel like I need a Lilawa. I just might as well, maybe no, I want to lay for my house. The house, yeah. yeah. So I yeah. think I want that. So hopefully, well, yes, I will be getting a new fragrance because why not treat yourself? Maybe I'll get one for Valentine's Day. Yeah. Who knows? So, um, yes, thank you guys for watching. Yeah. I hope you guys love this video. Um, like, comment, subscribe if you guys want to see anything else. If you have any other questions, um, I'll have Ardina's Instagram tag below her and then I'll also put it in the description box and if you guys have any questions this is like the fragrance connoisseur so don't ask me because I don't know but ask her she know everything about fragrances so it's if you so, have any it's questions terrible. it's so terrible her fragrance collection is crazy so if you have I'm any trying, questions I'm, I'm not buying any I'm like no so you have says, any problem we'll see oh, <laughs> what's on your fragrance wish list um uh a Clive Christian X oh yeah, we did smell that. That smells so. Oh. That smells good though. That was like five hundred dollars, right? Collaboration. Yeah, that, it smells so. That smells so good. And then we smell that other one. Oh, um, by well, the Harmonist. We smell Yen Transformation, so which was awesome. That was beautiful. But I really want. Um, I think the Hypnotizing Fire. Oh, that's the one you sent me. And then that sounds like it's the Keisha has Moon Glory by them. Uh -huh. Now that's the perfume. I'm telling you guys, when I smell it. Is that the one that made you cry? Yes! <laughs> I don't know what is in those people's stuff, but I literally, and she reminded me yesterday, she was like, not only did you cry, you were up against the wall. <laughs> as soon as I smelled it, tears came down my, that thing is an experience in a bottle too. It is the most beautiful smell I ever. I mean, Keisha, bring it next time but so I can smell. I want to smell it. I, I've never, I've been wearing perfume since I was your nephew's age. Like, yeah. I have never had a perfume do that to me. I, she was just like, you're not ready, you're not ready. And I was like, well, I smelled some harmonious things when we were in Neiman's. I think we were in Yeah, Neiman's. we went to Neiman's. And, but when I smelled it, like, something came over me. And I'm like, weeping. I said, what is, I said, there's something wrong with this thing. Like, who, who, who sent her? Like, right. Yeah, so definitely, um, 
yeah, that's proceed with caution because I don't oh, know. No. I need to so, smell that. But hypnotizing fire and hypnotizing fire, fire sound yeah. crazy too. I like smell like her. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. I'm trying to hypnotize. So those are my top two, but I'm really trying to be good because it's it's insane. Yes. But again, if you guys have any questions, ask Arlene because she knows everything. And thank you guys for watching. And happy I'll Valentine's see you next. Day. Oh, happy Valentine's happy Day Valentine's to all the day. lovers. Happy Valentine's Day yes. to all my girls. I hope you guys have fun. Be, mm -hmm. safe, be safe and um, have a great experience. And tell me all about it in the comments because I want to yes, know. Yes, yes. I want to see what y'all did. I want to see what y'all wore. So, yes, tag me in pictures, everything. And again, like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye.